What's up everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Got another movie reaction for you. And we're keeping the Tom Cruise Mission Impossible train rolling. We are coming off possibly the best of the series so far, the first three that we have seen. Mm -hmm. But here we are, number four. What is it called? Ghost Protocol. Very much looking forward to where this series continues to go. Three was awesome. I mean, they've all been awesome. Yeah. So, I mean, very minus enjoyable. the rock climbing, well, we're good. I mean, Nikki's very scared of heights, so she didn't like that moment very much. Even watching in a movie, she does not like seeing things falling. She doesn't like seeing those shots. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So that didn't work out very well for her. But yeah, Mission Impossible has been super cool. Been a lot of fun. If you guys it didn't is. know, we do movie nights every single week on the channel. And you should come join us. Live watch alongs. They're a great time interacting with y'all. Dad jokes for days. Yeah, it's a good time. So find those. Come join us. Come hang out. But yeah, here we go. Mission Impossible 4 Ghost Protocol. You ready? Yes. Let's go. Damn, this music. I know. I'm like getting nervous. Like, kind of chaos. Oh, shit. Oh, um, ah, oh God. Yeah, that would still hurt. Are you joking right now? Damn, dude. Guy's pay, he's pretty badass right there. That's wild. <gasps> Damn, fell from a... Top of a building still didn't make it. Damn, how many times she's shooting him? Holy Great shit. It's the classic cell phone distraction. Assassin. Wow. He went through all that just to die to a cell phone. Talent right there. Oh, hello. <laughs> Literally every camera just flashing on the thing, like, huh? <laughs> I honestly. I don't know. I would be like, I'm going to close this. I'm going to close this. Right? I don't want to get beat up or whatever the fuck. I'm going to close this. It's like, asshole. Why'd you have to yell? Thanks for ratting me out, dude. Thanks for blowing up my spot. Let's give you a few friends to play with. Uh-oh. Oh, <laughs> shit. <laughs> sorry, Mount. <I'm> sorry. <laughs> I mean, he just got an officer's ass beat. Probably gonna die. We're having a whole breakout here. Oh God. I'm in position. Move to phase two. Wait, how did he... Yeah, why is Ethan in a... Prison in yeah. Moscow. Like, no problem. I mean, from what we've seen so far in these first three movies, that was definitely a piece of cake. Dude, look at his back. Yeah, he looks kind of swole in this movie. It's all that rock climbing. No, I, no, I'm not. No, I won't. I will. I will not open that door. Go to the extraction point, Ethan. I, I know. I know what this means, but I. I can't. Go to the extraction point, Ethan. Go to the extraction point. Oh, we're gonna. <laughs> <you're> gonna... <laughs> Come on. 
Okay, fine, fine, <laughs> fine. <laughs> there. We'll just just screw the whole thing up on purpose. Oh my god. Like it doesn't matter what role he's in. He's so He funny. brings like a comedic aspect to it, like every time, no matter what. Oh. Oh god damn. Why do you want to go in that? Oh shit. Is that Vince That dude's probably Vaughn? not even that. That tall. dude looked like Vince Vaughn. No? Oh. Uh, uh, I don't know what he's doing. That guy was probably like 5'10. Yeah, right. <laughs> Did that not look like Vince Vaughn from the side? Buff is shit, so definitely not him. Rude. I love the music and just the absolute chaos that's going on. Right yes. Now. Oh, sh this is wild. Oh my god. Oh shit. This, this is fantastic, I gotta tell ya. Oh god. Oh dear. Oh shit. <laughs> this is incredible. That was really nice though, save his friend. Oh hell. Oh hell. <laughs> it looked like a tunnel to hell. Oh shit. Heads up. Son of a bitch. <laughs> that would have been a disaster if he got friggin' like shot through the face with that thing. Agent Hunt? And you are? Agent Carter. Light diffuse. There's the music. There, oh, yeah. Uh, what are they blowing up? Like, everything? Yeah, the entire prison or just the escape route. So, so far, through the intros of the first four movies, mm -hmm. three, still one of the best I've ever seen. Yeah. In terms of intros. Even though that prison scene was pretty epic. Yeah, it was. Damn. Big kablooey right there. Benji, how is it you're here? Oh, I passed the field exam. Crazy, right? <laughs> yeah, great. DNA test. It's me. Sergey, are you not Russian? Are you not Sergey? No. <gasps> oh! <laughs> That's so fucked up! I always take care of my friends. My friends. <laughs> That's, that's, that's kind of funny. Yeah, it is. You mind telling me what you were doing in a Russian prison? You mind telling me why you broke me out? This wasn't a rescue mission? If the secretary wanted me out of there, it must be pretty bad out here. Why does he look younger now than he did in the previous movie? Right. Uh... We were after a file. We lost it. We? Who lost it? You? Agent Hannaway. Where's Hannaway? Dang. It was a letter drop. Classified file. It should have been a simple intercept. By the way, I love how they had like a protocol to make sure that it was him. Yeah. Like, yeah. Because of the whole undercover yeah. thing they've established. Face in this. thing, yeah. yeah. Get it, girl. Oh, oh shit. <gasps> oh. So now or never, Bob Cat. Hurry, you're delivering the file. What's his name? Know him. Ugh. Stefanski. You got it? Marek Stefanski. Searching. That's so cool. That is really cool. You just put in a contact lens to find somebody? Damn. I'll take it from here. What is in that class ring? <laughs> oh. Hannaway dropped a mark and grabbed his bag. He had the file in his hands. File secure. But we weren't the only ones after it. Oh. 
The sounds. I know. Cracks and squishes. Hannaway's lens cam drew a facial match and triggered a warning. Oh, that's what happened. But it was too late. Damn. His facial recognition software in his eye triggered the phone to go off. Yeah. Based off of her being a freaking assassin. Yeah. That is insane. That is. It was my op. I put him in the field. And she left him just alive enough for me to see him die. That's brutal. That is awful. Who's in the file? Yeah, I thought someone else was sending him yeah. the info. I didn't realize it was his eye that triggered that. Russian nuclear launch codes. Okay. Awesome. Fun. This is going to be great. Oh, the fuck? Why was he in prison? He disappeared after he and his wife, you know. I thought he'd just been transferred, put uh, on leave. Did they, did they divorce? Welcome back, Mr. Hunt. In your absence, IMF has learned that Cobalt is or yeah, was a level one nuclear strategist so for Russian obvious. intelligence. The only way to uncover his actual identity is to infiltrate the Kremlin itself. In order to get past their checkpoints, you will be impersonating General Anatoly Fedorov. Your mission, should you choose to accept it, is to penetrate the is. highly secured archive inside the Kremlin and retrieve Cobalt's file before he can destroy it. To save time, we've chosen your team for you. Agents Carter and Dunn. Where's Luther? Should you or any member of your team be caught or killed, the secretary will disavow any knowledge of your actions. This message will self-destruct in five seconds. How's this one going to self-destruct? The whole thing is going to... I know, I think it's going to blow up. It's gonna, like, Or is it just going to smoke like the other one? It's a perfectly good telephone. Uh, uh, don't go back to it! Oh, there it is. You had to give it a little... Mm. You know. I still am very curious what happens if you choose not to accept the mission. Right? Like, what happens? Nah. Is it just like you go on with your life and do I'm your thing? I'm good. Or does someone come and pick you up because you're choosing not to accept the mission? Right? Like, I don't really want to. Where's Georgie? Oh my god. Red balloon? <gasps> You're so... I didn't even think of that! Of course! A red balloon floating? How could you not think of that? It's a shame we're not wearing masks. You know, like full masks. <laughs> Everybody gets to wear a mask but Benji. Benji, shut up! Stop talking to the third person! <laughs> wow, that's it's one hell of a balloon. Talk about stealthy drone. Yeah. Releasing in three, two, one. That's wild. That is really cool. That is wild. Game face, game face, Kremlin game face. You're only talking to yourself, Benji. Benji's one of those types that needs to like pump himself up. Yeah. I love every aspect of these movies when they're infiltrating something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's yeah. always so interesting. They always have such great plans. Oh wow. And I love their tech. Yeah. That's awesome. That is so funny. We picked water dripping. Would that really get me up out of my chair? Me for sure. I. Whoa. That is fucking awesome. I freak out about the sound of water in a house so bad. That is so awesome. 
<coughs> what other movie does this remind me of? Naked Gun of some kind. That is dope Aztec right there. Like, wow, it's like it an seems invisib- so much closer now. <laughs> yeah. It's the invisibility cloak. <laughs> That's so funny that they're using water drips. If you're trying to get me to, uh, you know, leave my post, that's definitely one way to, to do it. He's like, where the fuck is this water coming from? Honestly. I wouldn't give two shits. Do they I'd make like, the image smaller, like, as they get closer? <gasps> oh, shit. Benji. <laughs> Fucking Benji, dude. <laughs> Good thing they have no cameras from the other angle looking down the hall. Right. And that door made no sound. Yeah. Wow. They must have wd 40 that door <laughs> so good. <laughs> Why do I feel like Benji's going to like set off some kind of alarm? I swear to God. I feel like somebody's going to come up behind him. Uh-oh. The nest is empty. Uh-oh. Oh. <gasps> Ugh. That sounds awful. Check in, team leader. Over. Have you made it to the archive room? Capitan! Oh, no! Standing by to detonate. Abort. Who the iPad? Oh, God. Oh, shit. Oh, my God. Dude, that was a massive explosion. That Holy was not shit. just like fucking, oh, I detonate. Shit, that was blow up everything. Uh-oh. Oh shit. Our media is no more truthful than yours, but we both know that the real cause of the explosion was you. Uh oh. Awaiting your co-sign, team leader. Standing by to detonate. The worst part for you, team leader, is I am the man assigned to make you suffer for it. Uh oh. Oh shit. Master mouth reader. Mm-hmm. Uh -oh. He gone. Just like that. He's like, bitch, you ain't gonna make me suffer for shit. Yeah. Suffer this. Oh damn. Oh god. Can he hit that jump mildly concussed? <laughs> He's like, go for it. I'd like to see this. Oh my god, no. No, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you so much. No, I'm good. Not a good idea. Seemed like one a minute ago. <laughs> this is kind of funny. I mean, him climbing down from here should be easy work. Yeah. Oh, fucker. Uh-uh. <laughs> like, you don't know who you're fucking with. Oh, ah, uh, onto the floor. Onto the floor. God damn. Yeah, he's not all there right now. He's a little off his game. That was still really impressive. Mr. Secretary. Oh. Wasn't aware of you in Russia. I'm not. Not since a bomb blew up the Kremlin. Yeah. Yesterday I flew in to accept the order of friendship from the Russian Prime Minister. Well, bad timing. Oh, hey. My chief analyst, William Brandt. What's up, Hawkeye? The blame, right or wrong, points to IMF. The president has initiated ghost protocol. Oh. The entire IMF has been disavowed. Damn. Now I've been ordered to take you back to Washington. 
where the DOD will label you as a rogue extremist oh. and hang the Kremlin bombing on you and your team. Wow. Unless you were to escape. <sighs> Having uh, assaulted Mr. Brandt and me. He's like, the fuck? <laughs> I don't want to get assaulted, Dick. What the hell? Sir, you may wonder. You will then disappear. <laughs> That's great. And this conversation never having taken place, that your intentions would be unclear. But if any one of your team is caught or killed, they will be branded terrorists. Damn. Your mission. If you choose to accept. Should you choose to accept. Oh, okay. Should you Are choose? you gonna blow up in five seconds? <laughs> Ethan, you are my best man, and I'm sorry it's come to this, after all the sacrifices you made. If we don't meet again, I just want you to know, I've always considered you a friend. <gasps> uh... Oh, whoa! Oh god, into water, into water, into water. This was in the opening credits. Dude. Take good breath. Stay with me. Hell no, I would have died right there. Oh, oh shit. Oh. Uh-uh. I can't hold my breath for that long, bitch. Oh god. Jesus. I'm a terrible swimmer. I would have been dead. Absolutely dead. These movies have done a really good job with, like, shocking moments. Mm -hmm. Why would that work? Flare on the body. Why, why would that work? It did work. Yeah, I know, but... Hey. I mean, how'd you know that would draw their fire? I didn't. I played a hunch. Oh, my God. All right, so what was your scenario, right? You, there's a guy being shot at in the water. All of a sudden, decides to light up a flare and swim around. I mean, what'd you assume they'd be thinking? I didn't assume they were thinking. I assumed they were shooting at anything that moved. I just gave them a target. These guys are both scholars, you know? <laughs> Damn. You know what that sound is? It's all right out of here. Oh, oh. oh my God. Enter your code. Oh. Press enter. <laughs> oh my god. Retinal scan required. Retinal scan required. Agent confirmed. The fuck? <laughs> this is this is where it reminds me of the Matrix, like you know, the phone ringing Ethan? in some random Jeez, place. Oh my god, they're alive! <laughs> I love just random, like, payphone, friggin' random train car, just... IMF now believes this man, Kurt Hendricks, is a nuclear extremist, codenamed Cobalt. Today he was seen leaving the Kremlin with what is likely a nuclear launch device. That's wild. Two days ago, Sabine Moreau killed one of our agents in Budapest. Intel indicates she will check in at the Burj Hotel in Dubai in 36 hours. Marius Wistrom is a known operative of Cobalt. Wistrom is currently en route to Dubai. For the launch device to work, Cobalt needs the activation codes. He's sending Wistrom to buy them from Moreau. The president has invoked Ghost Protocol. We're shut down. No satellite safe house, support, or extraction. The four of us, the contents of this car, are all that remain of the IMF. And as of this moment, any action is unsanctioned. So if you want out, Speak now. We're good? Okay. No one can know we're still online. We lose Hendrix now, we lose him forever. <laughs> Wistrom will take delivery from her own 36 hours. We need Wistrom to lead us to Hendrix. Our objective is to intercept the sale, place the authentic codes with counterfeits, and follow Wistrom to Hendrix. Well, that's, that's simple enough. 
<laughs> Simple enough. <laughs> I know, right? It's easy. Like, no big deal. The fact that he has, like, such a perfect plan so quickly is so awesome. But where the fuck is Luther? Oh, Damn it. Honestly, Luther. He better be in Dubai when we get it? there. They brought the face 3D printer. Oh, did they? Yeah. Or it had the head thing. As you do. So I assume we're going to find a way to infiltrate the giant Dubai hotel from the top. Don't do that. Don't do that. Burj Khalifa, the tallest building in the world, and you want to alter its infrastructure with the hopes of convincing two people that they had a meeting which actually really never happened, right? Uh, uh. Yeah, don't run over the camels. Jeez. Come on, Ethan. <laughs> Look at that. Look at that. Yeah, that's the world famous hotel in Dubai. How many floors are in that bitch? I don't know a lot, but I, they did a uh, Fast Sorry. and Furious in that building too, I believe. Yeah, not to be offensive, it's not an actual bitch. It's just that's the word I use. But goddamn. Okay, and, and, and this is a slight wrinkle, but no, nothing, nothing to worry about. We're just oh gonna have God. to go into the server room from the outside. What? Yeah. What? Firewalls on this building server are military grade. I mean, I mean, this would be a cinch if I could call Yusuf back at headquarters, but Yusuf doesn't exist anymore, and, and, and neither do we. <laughs> if we can't get you the server, we don't control the elevators, we don't control the security cameras. This operation's over before it even begins. I'm telling you, we can get to it from outside. We? We. <laughs> we. What floor is it on? Oh, 130. Oh, hell no. Piece of cake. Oh, we're going to go outside. Oh, I don't want to. Piece of cake. Oh, I'm good. Thank you so much. I like the inside. How am I supposed to do this? <gasps> oh, bitch. That just scared me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's how I. Did we have to cut out the whole? Uh... Okay, now remember, it's a rolling off motion that disengages the bond. I'm Batman. <laughs> Blue is glue. And when it's red, dead. Oh. Hotel server's 11 stories up and seven units over. Yeah. Copy. He doesn't seem very, like, confident in this situation right now. I'm not. I'm definitely not. This is... Probably the first time I could recall Ethan looking not comfortable with the plan. I don't know, but look at those calves. Get it. Nikki's favorite part. Climbing on the side of one of the tallest buildings in the world. <laughs> Red means dead. <laughs> And if you're new to the channel, Nikki is horrified of all kinds of heights, even when watching in a movie. So this part is... <laughs> he just cast. <laughs> He's so nervous. This is great. <laughs> that shot is lovely. I feel sick. <laughs> I love just to make sure to show you how far down it is. is that? Is that a Dubai sandstorm? Oh, hell no. That's a sandstorm. Yeah. That's a long way off, Ethan. Shouldn't be a problem. Shouldn't Dubai, be a problem. Dubai's got crazy sandstorms because it's all desert. One of those is turning red and... Oh my god. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay. Oh, I don't I don't like it. Oh, I you can fuck off. No. Are you kidding me? What the This is crazier than the rock climbing. Oh, no, 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 no. Of course, give you the big zoom out, show you just how high he is. 
This makes my eyes water. That's the most amazing suction of all time. Holy shit. Look at the way he is holding himself up. Are you kidding me? Uh-uh. Oh, <gasps> oh God. <laughs> That is incredible. Ugh. Fuck your gloves. Fuck those things. Hail to the no. I love seeing them make the masks. That is everything. I love that. Are you kidding me? Uh uh. This motherfucker is running down the freaking hotel. They, uh, uh, they make this shit look real realistic. I gotta tell you. Uh uh. Uh uh. Is there no one else in any of those rooms being like, what is happening? Honestly. No shit! <laughs> no! Mm, I don't like it! Oh, you fucking kidding me? <gasps> oh, oh, shit. Oh, bitch. Uh-uh. Uh. -uh. uh -oh. I gotta go. I gotta go. I gotta go. I gotta go. I can't watch this. Incredible. Incredible. That whole scene was incredible. That was not easy. <laughs> but what? Fuck off, Benji. <laughs> you Fuck just went and changed off. some hotel room numbers while this motherfucker just scaled and flew himself into a room from I don't know how many stories. What wow. are they going to do with this? Maybe that'll create more of a easy way to create a diversion, especially with identity. If there's like a crazy sandstorm coming. That's Leonid Lysenker, Polish-born cryptographer. He's here to authenticate the launch codes. Make an exact copy of the launch codes. Well, you can't do that. You're talking about handing over active nuclear launch codes to which one? We broke in the case. Now listen, you're moving fast. It's not gonna happen. <gasps> oh, bitch. I don't, get away from the fucking window. I don't like it. We lose Hendrix today. He shows up somewhere else tomorrow. He finds another way with no IMF to stop him. It's now or never. Now, Brant, give me the case. Stop walking closer to the window. <laughs> Ugh. Oh no. We go without. We have no choice. Ethan, you'd be walking in on a row unarmed, face first, literally. I have no choice. Shit. Which one of you is Wistrom? Which one of you is Wistrom? I am. I admire your work. They just got fucking lucky as shit. Where are my codes? Where are my diamonds? Close by. You have my payment? When I see the codes. I thought we could have tea. No diamonds, no codes. No codes, no diamonds. It seems we've reached an impasse. <laughs> oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god! We're good. Oh my god, dude, the fucking anxiety is wild right now. Okay. Hey, I, I did as you asked. I did. Now, let my family go. Release Leonid's family. Thank god. <laughs> you can thank him in person. Oh my god.
We're just gonna ha we're just gonna have him loose in a purse. Bitch, you gotta take the stairs in this case. Who's waiting for an elevator when they're, death is on the line? They're a hundred something floors up. I know, but like, get you to it. taking those floors. That's a get lot to of another level before you try to just. I'm just gonna take the elevator to try and get it away from people trying to kill me. Bitch, no. She's a trained assassin. And she's not worried about that shit. Oh, she. Sh oh my god. We're good. We're good. We're good. You and I are not enemies. It was a setup. We'll find should. out your lies soon enough. Well, shit. Wow, that escalated quickly. Escalator. I got it! <laughs> Good job. <laughs> Go for Benji. I've got lead by the elevators. He's been shot. What? <gasps> Don't oh turn your. Ow! Elbows. Bitch! What kind of fight is this? <gasps> oh shit! Uh, no, no! Ah! For the fucking corkscrew? Bitch! Oh god! Oh shit! Damn! Right in the baby maker! Oh my god! Oh god. Oh god, they're near an open window! They're near an open window! Oh god damn! Oh shit. Ooh. That's a dope ass shot! Holy shit! Look at this friggin' sandstorm rolling in. Don't think you want like, to be why are all these people running towards it? And they're trying to get inside. They're not Does like this running. happen often? I would have, yeah. Oh, so. hell on earth, no. <gasps> I don't know if that's what it looks like. Ah, uh, this is awful. You're not gonna be able to breathe. Am I right? Can't see nothing. Sand that gets everywhere, right? What was this? What was this? It's saying? coarse. Gets everywhere. Those goggles came in real fucking handy. My God. <gasps> Oh damn. Oh motherfucker. What? Oh. oh it's not him! There's the twist. Dun dun dun. How do you drive and look at that shit at the same time? You're even You don't. Hunt. Yeah. <laughs> I I how do you how do you drive in this? The way he is by crashing into everything. No, but like other people are on the road also. How are you driving in a sandstorm? This is nuts. Even their barriers are full of sand, not water. Oh shit. Here we go. Chicken, you don't even know. What? <laughs> Hell yeah! He just jumped out of a freaking speeding ass car. No problem. And he's not in there. What? Okay. The stuff people survive in these movies is amazing. It is. How the hell did the Russians find us? 
What are you asking me for? Because your communications, you're in charge of covering our tracks. You're not a technician anymore. You're a field agent. And you're just an analyst. Right? Who are you really, Brent? Let me see if I can put it in another way. Oh, son of a bitch. Oh, goddamn. See the muscles on that guy's forearms? Shit! Well, we all have our secrets. You tell me yours, I'll tell you mine. Spill it. Well, what are you gonna do? Change the plan. Wait, what are we gonna do? Go after him alone? Oh, he already walked out of the room, bud. Yeah. <laughs> you can't explain yourself, Agent Brandt. We're listening. Yeah, everyone's got their secrets. I mean, clearly, when he was, like, whooping ass, Ethan was like... Who the fuck are you? Yeah. I was on a protection detail in Croatia, shadowing the assets, husband and wife. They were never supposed to know we were there. Whole thing's routine. It was a milk run. They caught wind that a Serbian hit squad was after our couple. They couldn't shake this feeling that I should warn the couple somehow. But, you know, orders are orders, so I didn't. One day, the husband decides to leave the hotel, so I follow him, and I leave two men with the wife. When I get back, my guys are unconscious and the wife is gone. Oh, shit. Local police found her body three days later. What was left of her, anyway? Ugh. That was my last day in the field. I couldn't face another life or death situation after that. So what happened to the husband? Never saw him again, until two days ago in Moscow, when the secretary introduced me to Ethan Hunt. Oh, oh, what? No. That's not what happened. She left him. Yeah, I heard that one too, Benji. Oh, no. I was there, just like I was there when the secretary got the phone call that Ethan was in custody for killing six Serbian nationals in cold blood. An unsanctioned hit. Yeah. Disavowed. Oh, shit. So that's why he ended up in prison. Yeah. Poor Julia. Next thing I know, I'm on a plane to Dubai, wondering the whole time, do I tell him? How do I tell him? That I'm responsible. Oh, <sighs> shit. I could have warned him. I should have warned him. <sighs> that is so brutal. Okay, to shut down the satellite, we have to manually tap into the central server. Now, you'll enter through the exhaust vent wearing this. Uh, drop down into the computer array, and I'll catch you. What? I'm sorry? It's a hover suit? <laughs> of course it is. Of course it is. It's a 25-foot drop, and we're using magnets. Yeah. <laughs> The technology is... The sound. science is sound, all right? I'd be more worried about the heat. I'm sorry? Then there's that. What heat? Well, it's like any computer, isn't it? If you switch off the fan, it's gonna get really hot. <laughs> of course. Relatively, yeah. <laughs> oh my God. So I'm, I'm jumping into... Uh, Hell. Uh, an oven. <laughs> I'll catch you. <laughs> you can feel the level of trust is yeah. very high. Tom, check. Saturn's got you five by five, Jupiter. This is Pluto. <laughs> I have arrived at the bus. No one's Uranus. Why? We're all thinking it. <laughs> Come on. Too easy. <laughs> Hey, you gotta have the amount of wit that I have. Damn it. Holy shit. Why am I Pluto? It's not even a planet anymore. Well, I think Uranus is available. Thank you, Jeremy Renner, for making that joke. Is that true? Is Pluto not a planet anymore? No, now it's like a moon, I guess. Mm. Which, I don't know shit sucks. about anything. I don't know. Was it ever made official official or? I don't know. I'm sure someone it's will let us know. It's just hearsay. Okay. Jumping now. <laughs> this is great. Oh. Jump now? Hell no. Yes. Commit. Jump. Jump. 
You're sure about this suit, right, Najee? <laughs> pretty sure. Pretty, pretty oh, sure. Oh, now we're pretty sure. <laughs> yeah. I love the way they incorporate the comedy in this in these movies. Damn, dude. <laughs> what was that about? Did you jump? Should I not have jumped? <laughs> I fucking love this. Oh my god. I'm playing a hunch. Don't hit me. My god, you are a passionate creature. I would like to show you my collection of art. Is that what we're calling it now? A collection of art? I'm heading upstairs. I like how that water just squirted right then. <laughs> like, hey -o. <laughs> Symbolism. <laughs> See, this feels more like the Ethan Hunt role. Like, he should be the one doing this part. Yeah. But Ethan needed to be on the floor. Because he did the whole Ethan, like, ah! Yeah. Thing. Yeah. Uplink to satellite. Reboot to original military specs. Download the virus. Oh, motherfucker. What the hell is that? What the hell is that? It's downloaded a virus from the satellite. Hendrix is reprogramming the satellite. He's gonna have launch capability in five minutes. Oh, shit. <laughs> Move and I break your neck. The override sequence for the relay station. Say it now or never speak again. The system's crashed. We're too late. Oh, shit. Oh, fucker. Oh shit. Hell no. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. You need some fizzy bubbly soda from Willy Wonka. <laughs> do not, do not turn the fans off. Oh my god. Can we stop fucking doing that shit? No. <gasps> Wow, that was amazing. Holy shit. Связаться с центральным командованием для подтверждения запуска. Слушай, приступить к операции железный кулак. Команда на запуск подтверждена. Отключить радиопередатчик. Продолжим. Oh shit. We're too late. The missile's in the air. Oh no. Did he start Sorry, like he, he jumped over a mini. Look no, but that. like he was like in the air before he even like jumped. That was an impressive car slide. He did the one in the last movie too, I believe. Those freaking car parks, awesome. Oh, Ooh. shit. Not when you're... Oh, my God. Oh, um, shit. Not when you're that high up and you're... Uh... Oh, shit. Ah! How... Dude, his bell has gotten rung a bunch. <laughs> Your bell it's rung. So insane. <laughs> Surprise, bitch. Oh. <gasps> <laughs> oh shit. Oh, that car is moving. Watch out. Oh. Fuck. It's my oh. knee. Oh. <gasps> oh this is insane. Who's liable for these broken windows? The car park or the owner of the car? I'm sure you have to sign a waiver, I would imagine. Oh, shit. It's like the claw machine. 
Did he fucking break his leg? Yeah, that, I mean, that crunch, I would assume, simulates a broken leg. That shit sounded horrible. Oh, God. Right? Oh, bitch. <laughs> What the fuck was that? I think he was like, I'm gonna sacrifice myself because he knows he's not gonna be able to get down there fast enough to get the oh, case. Okay. So he's like, I'm dying for the cause kind of thing, I feel like. Ooh. What are you gonna do? We're gonna jump the break in the freeway. <gasps> oh God! Oh. <laughs> Are you serious? They're <laughs> fucking with me. Good thing he picked a safe car. <laughs> he would still die. Is that an advertisement? What was that, an Audi? I don't know what that was. This is so insane. He just fell like a couple hundred feet in a car, nose down, no problem. What? How the fuck is that guy still alive? Nah, -uh, bitch. Nah. -uh. No. Mission accomplished. Uh oh. Oh, bitch. Got him. Let's go. Good job, Benji. Wow. How would you even have like the wherewithal in your brain to be like this? I need to. He wouldn't. <laughs> After that fall that that dude had, there's no shot. Which is what makes these movies so fun. The outrageousness is always great. You actually said that. <gasps> there he is. Mission accomplished. I said it. I'm still corny, you I can't imagine the look on that guy's face. Finally, with like five minutes left in the movie, friggin' Luther shows up. Carter, Dunn, and Brent. I blew an entire weekend on the bottom of the San Francisco Bay, well, thanks to you, Clown. <laughs> oh, man, you know I got this. I know. Ah! <laughs> I'm using that next time. We were unprepared in the dark, disavowed. And the only thing that functioned properly on that mission was this team. I don't know how we ended up together. I'm glad we did. Solid. What are you Solid. gonna tell him, though? There's no way you can, like, do you? Your missions. Choose to accept them. There you go. Hey, look, I'm in. <laughs> Seriously, I mean, it's not as if any mission's gonna be rougher than the last one, is it? <laughs> they seem to keep escalating, so... I'm not picking up that phone, Ethan, because I don't think you want me in the field. I know your wife is dead. I was there in Croatia. I was there for one reason, and I failed. It was my job to protect her. How do you know she's dead? There was a body. Did you see it? You, you killed those Serbians. I had to get her back. You were sent to rank out prison. That was a sacrifice I was willing to make. Oh, shit. You can never believe what you see. Secretary never told me. I accepted the rank out prison mission on one condition. That no one could know she was still alive. You're telling me. When did you find out that I was in Croatia? I pulled your file after India. So you had to fake your wife's death. As long as we're together, she can never be safe. Mm. It wasn't your job to protect her, Brent. It's mine. Mm -hmm. So we're good. We're good. Good. That was... Uh... Wow. 
That's gotta suck, right? Perfect lighting, though. Of course. Good evening, Mr. Hunt. 36 hours ago, there was a breach in our military's communication network. An emerging terror organization known as Syndicate has control of our entire drone fleet. For vision. <laughs> and it just keeps on rolling. Hell yeah. Oh, look at that. The ghost. Awesome. Another really cool, fun, awesome, well done Mission Impossible movie. <sighs> that it was. That, I... The way they continue to up the stakes in these, like, storylines and the movies and the action sequences and just everything about these movies from one to four so far... It's been so enjoyable. It's been so much fun. I, I'm i happy we got a Luther cameo at the end. Honestly. I was waiting for... like <laughs> They've gotten to the point with these first three where I'm like, all right, where's he going to pop up? And it wasn't too distracting because the story was really good and the mission was... Like, Benji's was doing his best. I mean, Benji... Be the comic relief. Benji's addition to this, I love that dynamic that he brings mm -hmm. because He's really funny. <laughs> in everything that he does, he just has this ability to make things feel fun and just make you laugh. Even the most stressful moments yeah. where it's like, holy shit, is Brant going to die? It's like, jump. Benji's just in jump. control and it's yeah. like unbelievable. But yeah, I, I'm digging these movies. I think they all, they're all fantastic. Every time, you could tell that there's like a jump in the year that the movie came out. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And it's just so clear. And this series continues like four movies in. I can't wait to see where they go with the next one. Yeah. I'm super intrigued. We got the mission there at the end. And just the way they're, they've got an incredible ability of subverting expectations. Yeah. I think they do such an amazing job with it and just every storyline, just the way they handle things that you never know who the hell is who or where or what or what's happening. No, because anybody could be wearing a face yeah. mask. Benji didn't get his mask, which is <sighs> unfortunate. I feel like that's going to be a fun payoff at some point. I feel like they're going to... They're going to get Benji his mask at some point. I they feel like we're going to get to that level. Yeah. And I feel like that's one if of those things. he's in the next one, yeah. I'm sure. I mean... He's now one of those characters where it's like, Benji's got to be in the next movie. Like, he has to be. And I hope we get Luther again. I don't know what his future looks like in this. If if this was like, just throw him in there just because kind of situation. Or if he's going to be in that. I'm not going to look and see who's in what because it's part of the fun. Yeah. These movies have amazing casts. And I think I part of the fun. Yeah, yeah, part of the fun is seeing when Jeremy Renner pops up and they're like, oh shit, cool. Yeah. Like he felt like the Emilio Estevez from one. Yeah. Like he felt like that kind of role. But the way even oh. his character was introduced. Emilio. And Emilio. Oh. But the way his his character was introduced, he was like a certain thing. And then he ended up being not bad and being like super badass. But there's a reason why he was where he was. And it was linked to Ethan. But he thought his wife was dead. And his job was to protect his wife. And it, like it's not what you thought. Expectation subverted. And I just think it's so cool the way these movies play out. And the stories are fun. And again, just the constant level of in same action sequences that building scene the moment i knew we were going to that hotel in dubai because it's been in a bunch of things and it's famous yeah i'm like they're gonna they're, they're gonna do something with that aren't they heights man heights i can't handle heights in any level uh, movies shows video games Especially if it's first person. She doesn't handle it well at all. Ugh. So. No. The fact that we were the in. The fucking wind could blow and you'd be out. I mean. You're gone. You're dead. Oh, hell it no. was so obvious that he was like using those gloves and that one of them, when they were like talking about like, oh, well, blue means you're good. And what does red mean? Like you're dead. So obvious that one of the gloves was going to hit red. But still, the way they were able to execute that moment, knowing that it was coming. So good. So well done. And I mean. 
So then he's just like laying there, like against the like glass and just chilling, like no big deal. The Ugh! fact that and and then he gets to where he was going, mm-hmm. mint, like gets that mission accomplished, sort of, and then flies out with, like I don't know what he used as like the rope or whatever, but it wasn't long enough, and he had to like swing back and fly through, like okay, absolutely but incredible. Jer- Jeremy Renner's character just like jumps out like not even yeah. thinking about it like oh yeah Carter's got my back no big deal I'm just gonna fucking jump for it grab it hell yeah no this movie it is set an expectation and it's impossible to not have one would it be Mission Impossible I mean yes going into it like expecting <laughs> an absolutely outrageous yeah. amazingly well done action sequence I mean, the the little fight scene with those cars and that parking thing, the structure was incredible. And just watching them have to jump and the fighting and the crackling of the bones. And, and then the one dude's like, I'm just going to jump. I'm going to like, for the cause, you're not going to get these codes. You're not going to be able to abort this mission. Jumps down, flat out like kills himself. And then Ethan's like, how do I get down there quickly? Oh, I'm going to get in a car and crash it a couple hundred feet down and airbags and a he would have fucking died. There's so many times that he would have died in these movies so far. And I think that's part of the fun. Yeah. It is just absolutely incredible watching just how they friggin' keep taking it up a notch with these crazy moments. Yes. And this movie had a few of them. Yeah. And <laughs> it's just ever since I feel like the third movie, it starts and the shit doesn't stop. It literally doesn't. I feel like there were moments in one and two where there was more downtime, I feel like. I mean, there's like a couple in here, but not, no, like nothing crazy. But it's all intense. Even yeah. their like chill moments feel super intense because nuclear war is at stake. Like, hello. But like two or three, just from the moment of that intro, which is one of the best intros I've ever seen in anything, to the end of the movie, it felt nonstop. Yeah. And this one was the same. So, I mean, they're great. They're fun. I, I can't believe I haven't watched these Mission Impossible movies. No, but it's just we are now. so insane. And I mean, Ethan Hunt is such an incredible character. And every movie, he proves to have a crazy skill that's just like, like, what can't this dude do? In this one, he literally did a perfect sketch of a dude that he was like trying to identify on his hand in pen. <laughs> yeah. He's like, hey, this is who I'm looking for. Like, what? The last one, he's a master lip reader. I mean, he's got acrobatic skills. He's a professional rock climber. He could shoot people from any angle and contorting his body in any like He's incredible. It's just this small little thing of being able to literally draw a face like that on your hand. That incredible. Was, that was funny. That's just so wild. So overall, uh, another really fun one. How many more are these? I think there's... there's so that was four, right? 23? Two more. <laughs> two more available for us to watch okay. until I think seven comes out. Okay. Right? So five, six, and then seven is the one that just, I think, was just in theaters. You guys have to let us know if you want us to continue to watch these. Figure that out. But something that's fun, always fun to do, is ranking movies. Where do you put this one in the four? It's like one. mm. Well, you put three number one last week. Uh Oh. My rankings, I still put... I still Are you going to let me finish? Well, you were taking a minute. I was going to spit it out. Okay, fine. Three, one, four, two. Oh, okay. I was going to put three, four, one, two. I think this one's better than one and two, but I don't think it's better than three. I, I don't like it more. I thought the, I mean, Hoffman as a villain in three that was, really good. was incredible. Yeah. And I thought, I, I don't know. I, I think I liked that one a little bit more. I think the overall cast of three made it a better movie, I think. Mm. Maybe. I mean, it's hard. It's very hard to rank because they're all awesome. And number two was the rock climbing shit. Yes. You, that lo- was, you lost yeah. me on that. That was like the slow-mo bird flying motorcycle scene yeah. craziness. Where like that one was, yeah, together. that movie was super over the, t- like it was very campy for an action flick, which I enjoyed the shit out of that movie. One, awesome. I think I would put three, four, one, two. I think that's where I'm at. And I'm three, one, four, two. Yes. Okay. Cool. Yep. You guys leave all your rankings, of course, because ranking movies is fun. It is. It's very enjoyable and it's a good time. So 
Yeah, but regardless, it doesn't mean that any of these movies are bad. No. I've enjoyed every single one of them. Yes. They are so fun, so enjoyable, great action series. Incredible. And again, Ethan Hunt's an incredible character. This is, I can't wait to see what he's going to do in the next movie. And the next one, and then the next one, and then the next one. So, yeah. yeah. All right. You guys leave all your comments. What are your thoughts? We'll catch you guys later for the next one. Have a good one. Bye.